Hello, Facebook friends. It's Carla, your online doctor, with today's Live in 5. Today is Wednesday, February 12th at 5.05 p.m. There's some kids playing right outside my window, so if you hear all kinds of fun and screaming going on, blame it on them. <laughs> it's good to hear. Okay, so with Valentine's Day around the corner... Um, do we let our health conscious plans go out the window to celebrate or can we find health conscious gifts to give and to receive? So let's talk about some options that you could consider. You could kind of put out there to your significant other to say, hey, this is what I want. I don't want to go off my health, uh, my diet or whatever it is. When I say diet, I mean how you eat right? So number one, a healthy snack box. Okay, so many of them are available for delivery. Gray's is a company in the United Kingdom and Earthbox, spelled U-R-T-H, box, are two that I found when I was searching around. Organic, non-GMO, and even paleo and keto options are available. Now, it may not sound very glamorous, but if you or your significant other are really serious about your health, it really says, I love your decision to be healthy. As much as I may want to buy you chocolate, if you don't want chocolate, this may be the gift for you and I should be happy giving you what you want, right? Isn't that what it's all about? It's not giving people what you want, it's giving people what you think they want to receive. Number two option is organic tea. So you can find these options, uh, again, there's so many options online. If you Google organic tea, you can find uh, gift boxes, you can find all kinds of different sets. They have delicious options of green, black, white, and even matcha teas, and healthy herbs and other fruits and berries that get added in to make them flavorful. Really a fun gift to give somebody, especially somebody who likes tea, but if that's something that they enjoy, it's a real healthy gift to give someone. Number three, cooking gifts, right? If your significant other loves to cook, especially if you like the way they cook and you want to encourage it, you can find gifts of organic high quality olive oil, organic flavored vinegar, and even spice blends that will excite them into creating an amazingly healthy Valentine's Day meal, right? That could be fun. Number four, healthy bars. Okay, my husband would be thrilled if I bought him boxes of his favorite energy bars or whatever that he likes to eat. Okay, so whether you like Cliff Bars, Kind Bars, Lava Bars, Laura Bars, excuse me, or the RX Bars, for example, or if you prefer to make your own, which isn't really that hard, by the way, if you find yourself a nice good recipe, giving someone a gift you know they will enjoy is clearly the thing to do. Hello, Cecilia. Number five, another option for the cook or the chef in your life is a garden at home or an indoor garden. Buying fresh herbs can be a real pain when you want to cook, um, but many of them grow very easily indoors. You can buy sets that grow basil, oregano, parsley, and all kinds of other spices and herbs if, the, if that's what, you know, the ones that you like. So the chef in your life can actually have those fresh herbs right at their fingertips every single day when they want to cook because there's nothing better, hello Marla, there's nothing better than fresh herbs and spices when you are cooking. Number six for the yogi in your life, right? Buy them a yoga mat. Okay, that is unmistakably theirs. I saw this great website. You customize it by actually choosing the color, but also you can have their name embroidered on it and you can have their favorite mantra embroidered on it embroidered on it as well, making it really a fun, personalized gift saying, again, I support your healthy habits and this is a gift for you. Number seven, for the runner in your life, and I have a couple of friends that I'm speaking to. Um, these look so nice. I found it on Etsy. Um, there are many options. It's called a chalkboard backed race bib and metal holder. It's like a big thing on the board and you put your, your most recent, recent 
race bib on it, but then there's hooks, almost like you would hang keys, but you hang your medals that you receive at each of your races, right? So they can write their stats on it because it's a chalkboard and hang their hard-earned hardware right from the hooks. Um, and if you have a true uh, running fanatic, you might need to get two of these <laughs> because I think the one I saw had about, I don't know if it was like 12 or 16 hooks, but you can hang multiple medals on each one. But definitely a really nice thing because where else do you put that stuff? I mean, we're not kids where you have a shelf with all their trophies, but as an adult, if this is your passion and you like to run, don't hide the medals, put them out there for people to see because you've worked hard to get them, so be proud, right? So again, if you have somebody in your life that that's appropriate for, get it for them because it's a really nice gift. Okay, now there are so many more healthy options that I wanna share with you, but we're gonna have to continue tomorrow. So let's continue this healthy Valentine's gift options. It doesn't have to only be Valentine's Day, it could be birthdays or just because days, whatever you want. So yeah, for the tennis player in your life, oh, we'll have to think about that one. Maybe I can find something by tomorrow. So I hope you guys are having an awesome day. I will see you again tomorrow for another Live in Five.